Hello, welcome to Sharpie Tech. This is your boy Kojo Inketia. Well, in this video, I'm going to walk you through YouTube search engine optimization, which is which we normally call YouTube SEO. Well, when we talk about YouTube SEO, what does it mean? So I'm going to walk you through from the beginning to the end, from A to Z, the steps, the basics and the professional steps that can help you to be an expert in YouTube SEO, thereby giving you a lot of views. Now, before you proceed, I want you to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Give me a thumb up if you like this video. Give me a comment at the comment section. If you have any question, anything that you wish to ask, let's leave it at the comment section. And I'm going to return and give you an answer. There's no time to waste. What are you waiting for? Let's proceed. Okay, so now this is the video outline. So the first thing we are going to talk about is what is SEO? What does it mean? When we talk about search engine optimization, what does it really mean? The second thing you are going to talk about is YouTube SEO. So after teaching you what SEO simply means, I'm going to merge the SEO with YouTube, then explain what is YouTube SEO. Now, let's proceed. So the third one we are going to talk about is we are going to walk you through the powerful SEO tools that we have. Okay. Then we are also going to use one of the SEO which we call VidIQ to do keyword research. But I keep on saying that there are people on YouTube looking for answers to their questions, searching for things using the five the four wives and the one husband which is what when where when uh, where yes and which five wives and their husband which is how so they are asking questions with these five wives and the one husband now we will also proceed on how to use these keywords that you've made research about the question that people are asking how are we going to use that keywords to optimize our videos and with the help of TubeBuddy, we are going to optimize our video with the keyword we did research on VidIQ. Is it not amazing? Yeah, it is like very, very amazing. So now let's proceed to the first topic, which is what is SEO? Now SEO simply means search engine optimization. So which SEO, which stands for search engine optimization, is a set of practices designed to improve the appearance and position of web pages in organic search results. The underlying words here is practices. Second is appearance and positioning and organic search results. These are the key words that we are going to take into consideration when we talk about search engine optimization, SEO. Now, no, it is a set of rules, a practice that we have to practice. It's something that we need to practice, okay, on our videos, on our web pages, okay. So, in order for web, uh, in order for search engines to deliver our pages or our videos as organic results. I hope you understand. So simply means you need to follow a certain rules, a certain pattern or practices for you for search engines to understand you and show your pages or videos to people who are looking for answers that your page or video is all about. So now let's proceed to what is YouTube search engine. It might be simple. If you have any idea looking at what seo is combining that to youtube and you have any idea about that just leave it at the comment section i'm going to read it out next time i do a video so now youtube seo what is youtube seo youtube seo is a set of practices designed to improve the appearance and position of videos in youtube organic search results basically we just added youtube web pages then we replace the web pages with youtube videos okay or videos in youtube so basically you've created a video on youtube now the question is why are you creating this video 
is someone asking for this video yes we are going to find out with the keyword research when we do keyword research then we can get keywords that people are asking questions about or people are using in their questions then after you've got that then we have to implement that keyword on our videos our youtube videos so when we implement that um keywords on our youtube videos then youtube is youtube search engine is going to understand our video to be the exact answer to that keyword that people are asking on youtube remember youtube is the second largest search engine after google and mind you youtube and google yeah you know almost one company google owns youtube so basically their algorithms and their practices their rules might be the same so now let's proceed to the best seo tools there are many and lots of seo tools that we came across but i picked out my best four. Oh yeah my best four, and these are my best four. one google trends now um i want us to go and take a look at how google trends really work okay just a short sketch okay i'm going to just scream through okay so after you scream through then you talk about the main reason why we are doing this video okay so now let's proceed okay so the browser i am using is google chrome okay so i'm just going to search google trends over here so now before um the result shows let me explain uh, let me talk about google trends so google trends uh, belongs to google as i told you youtube belongs uh, belongs to google okay so basically um google trends is about something which is trending you know trending stuff so anything which is trending on google okay or any google product okay then you can get that um, thing over here i mean the keyword anything just anything okay so if something is trending and it's trending on google search engine it's going to show over there and if something is trending on um youtube is going to show over there and one good thing about google trends is it tells you the exact locations so let's say you want to search about what things which are trending in ghana or in any african country or any part of the world you just have to type in your location i'm talking plenty let's proceed so now you just click on google trends okay so you can type trends.google.com okay slash trends so i'll leave the link in the description down below so that you just click on it and you'll be redirected to this in case you want to use this so now you can check here this is my country ghana i'm i'm a proud Ghanaian. oh yeah <laughs> so this is my country ghana so and this is the search engine on google trends okay so you just search about anything that you want you want to know you, so they, they can tell you the percentage of which people are searching about i'm mean, understand better still you can just click on this um icon or let's say yes yeah, just icon is cool so you come to year in search you can talk about search you can also tr talk about trending search okay you can just click on trending searches i'm just skimming you through okay okay so this is daily search trends we didn't get any for ghana uh, there's nothing here for the past 24 hours which is a whole day there's nothing like that for Ghanaian. just click here change the country to your country um, one thing is uh, for this section there's no ghana in it okay so let's say in the usa there's a choose usa and look at this so within 24 hours uh, we have tom doe wally cleaver the new leaf it to beaver okay so you can also click here and talk about the 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 categories so let's say you are into sign and check just click on that so as you can see so which is the i don't know razor date death stalker so you can see this was just down and it, and it just shoot up okay so it just went up like that, just like that so that means this keyword trended for a certain period I hope you understand so as you can see the 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 graph 
was very very high and later it was coming down okay so that is how it is so as you can see this one china earth space station with this one it is going up it comes down then it goes up like that but right now looking at where it is it is at the apex okay so that is it so you can just come back here and click on explore so that is it so now with this we can do research okay you can just maybe you have any topic in mind you can just come and just type it over here so now with this is a place you can um oh yes this is a place you can choose ghana yes just choose ghana over here and let's see if they have something for Ghanaians. okay okay so topics rising topics in ghana so we have 2020 topic okay which is the first one 2020 we have ukraine country in europe it is trending in ghana so we have russian language spoken language is trending in ghana so let's say i click on 2022 topic i think i'm taking much time over here yes i want you to understand okay so now take note this is for web search okay so when i click here and click youtube search because we are here basically for youtube okay so as you can see in ghana which is july 3rd july this keyword was trending so looking at still 20, 17 17 july to 2023 uh, sorry 17 july to 23rd july still it is trending which is 76 thousand people are searching about this particular keyword other than so which means that this keyword is trending in ghana okay it's trending in ghana and looking at this uh this is the areas where they are searching about that particular keyword so you can see northern region is searching more about 2022 central region is testing about more to, uh, more of 2022 so that means we in the central region and the northern part of ghana are thinking about 2022 once we feel in the greater accra in the bronga half region are thinking about something that maybe you are going back 2021 so that is all about google trends so now so now let's talk about the second one which is the google ads okay so now what is google ads google ads basically is where you can set campaigns you run ads okay for people who be interested in what you offer so let's say i'm a business i do website development i do graphic designing i do um youtube boosting social media boostings and other stuff so let's say i want people to see my services i can just list them i can create a short video about it and go and place the campaign on google ads when you go to youtube you can see a small video will, will play before the video starts okay and sometimes in the middle of the video or and also at the end of the video these things that you see on videos on youtube are ads and you can do all those things on google ads i hope you understand but what does this get to do with getting keywords let me show you they have implanted a keyword research tool in google ads which is best for website bloggers i mean yeah anyone any person who has a website but youtube as well let's let, let's go okay so now you just type in google ads so that is it so um so when i when i so that is it just click on um one of these okay ads.google.com just click on that so you just click on start now so in case you have an account with it you just have to sign in okay so that is it so you can see i have an account i just click on get started and i'm just in i did two campaigns for kg yeah so yeah, as you can see yeah so don't look at my money i didn't spend it much okay so um so you just have to come and click tools and settings just click on that okay so as you can see you have keyword planner okay you have keyword planner just click on that So that is it so get search volume forecast discover new keyword let's click on it so that is it so i'm going to type in any keyword that i want so let's say uh, i am into traveling okay i do vlogging 
I travel to places and record about that places and other stuff. Let's say I want an idea about traveling. Okay, so all I have to do is just type in the keyword over here. For 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 example, traveling. Now take note. The language is English, and the country is Ghana. If you are not in Ghana, just click on that, and just close this. Okay and just type in the location that you are in okay that is it i'm in ghana there's no need okay just let's say ghana what is that ghana so ghana country then i click on that you can choose cities and other stuff but ghana is cool so after you are cool with everything okay you just proceed okay you just proceed because i've already chosen ghana that is why the save button is not showing okay so that is all so my country is ghana if you're not in ghana search for any country that you want so now i just click on get results okay so take note the result you are seeing over here is for web pages okay which is google trending keywords okay okay so now youtube is not showing here because these keywords does not do well on youtube okay it's not doing well on youtube so it is not going to help you okay so you can search about any other keywords that you want so this is basically what this website does for you it helps you to find keywords and it works best it works best for web pages okay for bloggers so that is why you are not choosing it as our best okay it's part of the best though so the next one is two buddy and the, the last one is vid iq this brings us to the end we are not going to talk about two buddy and vid iq right now but why because you are going to use it okay you are going to use it so we are going to the next topic so when we get to the next topic then you are going to make use of the vid iq then later the final topic then we make use of the two body so the next topic is keyword research with vid iq so in the next topic we are going to talk about how to do keyword research using the best keyword research tool for youtube okay which is vid i kill someone might be asking what about tubebuddy yes tubebuddy is great and it has its potential which we are going to use very very soon so now let's get to vid i kill and let's let me show you the power of the keyword tool in vid i kill let's proceed okay so now I'm, I'm i'm opening a new tab and just type in vid i kill vid i kill okay so vid i kill so now this is how the website looks like okay if you don't have any account on vid i kill just click on sign up with google account even if you have an account that's where you're going to click that's the best thing so you just click on that okay so this is a list of google account that i have if you are not seeing this section you might be seeing this section this section so you just type in your account details and we proceed okay so i so okay just uh, just type in your email over here so i'm going to use this so my email my password okay so type in your password so that is it so we have to wait for whether i to redirect us to their dashboard that's where you are going to regulate things okay so i've done a lot of stuff with vid iq so now checking this tool this is so far the powerful tool okay so we have the dashboard we have the daily ideas so they give you ideas okay so when you already have videos on your youtube channel they will give you daily ideas okay so when i click on daily ideas just like this so you can see how to make your blogger site look like a professional so it's a good idea so how to create a website in 10 minutes for my business with wordpress okay so how to earn 100k per month from 
Canva, okay, complete course. So these are the keywords that I use that can help me get a lot of viewers, okay. So if you upgrade to another plan, you can see more than three daily ideas, okay. So just click, just come over here and click on keywords. Now, so this is where I do my keyword research, okay. So you just have to type in the keyword you want to target. Let's say you are into traveling, just type in traveling. Okay. Now this is how it works. The overall score is 35, which is very, very low. Okay. People are searching a lot about this keyword. So people, a lot, so 82,000 plus searches have been made about this keyword. It's a lot, right? But the problem is, a lot of people have also created content about this video, this keyword, which means that when you make a video about this keyword, yours might not show at the search engine. Okay, it might not show at the top of the search engine. Let me tell you how the search engine works. Okay, so when you go to YouTube, just like this, I'm coming. When you come to YouTube, okay. When you come to YouTube and search about, let's say, traveling, and you, you just click enter, okay? You search about traveling. Now, just check, take a look at this. These are videos about traveling, okay? And people are showing up on the search engine. This is the first guy, okay? So this video is the top most. Looking at this video over here, YouTube is trying to tell us that this is the best video so far. So whenever someone search about traveling, they are going to see this video. But mind you, it keeps on changing. Okay, YouTube keeps on changing. So what will make your video appear on the top of the search over here? What will make your video appear there? So that is why you need to do a keyword. People are searching a lot about it, but a few people have created videos about it. You get it? If you didn't get it, forget about it. Okay, so now let's proceed. So that is basically what we mean by YouTube search, okay? Why is important to do keywords for your YouTube videos, okay? So let's get back to vidIQ. So when I click on vidIQ over here, so people have created lots of videos about this. So how on earth can you compete with these people, okay? How on earth? When I, when I open this video and open this video, I'm opening the top three videos, okay? Let's check the subscribers and let's check the number of videos this YouTube channels have, okay? Let's check. So when I click on this first channel, okay, so I'm using a tool called um, Keyword Everywhere, okay? When it loads, it will give me the overview, okay? okay so this is the first video that shows when you search about traveling first video now let's check over here the optimization score is 96 almost 100 they have really really optimized they did a keyword research they have used the keywords very properly okay the reason why they are getting higher score is they might be they might be having videos which is related to traveling so youtube understand their channel to be a traveling channel so you can't compete with them simple like that okay so just check check over here so views they get per view is seven thousand within a day they are able to get 7k okay then let's talk about something here okay let's go here so this to check their subscribers they have seven million subscribers 7 million plus subscribers, which is 7,630,000 subscribers. Can you compete with them? How many subscribers do you have? You just have less than 1K, less than 10K, and you want to, you want to compete with over 7 million channel with those only traveling videos. Come on, you can't challenge. That is why you need to search our keywords. People have been created a lot videos are about especially when you are a new channel you get it let's go to the second video so the second video over here just take a look at this 
So their optimization score is a bit low. Okay. Now check their subscribers. They have 21k subscribers. Okay. And the the, the let, let's just click on their channel. Let's go and check. Okay. Just click on their channel like this. Okay. So now let's check. Look at the number of videos they have. Just click on videos. Just check out the videos they have. Can you compete with them? They have a lot of videos, okay? So you cannot compete. You have to, f and and mind you, they are showing at, they are showing at a top cent because they they did the video for a very long time. Just check here, okay? Just check. They six years ago that they did this video and they are showing up here and they have two point nine million views, okay? So what I'm trying to tell you is, it is no good to make videos about a keyword okay a keyword which a lot of people have created a videos about okay so even if you the uh, within a day they are uh, within a month they are able to get a lot of uh, search about that keyword don't try compete with the big man try to be in your zone find people who are low like you and challenge them whilst your channel growing in that is where you can compete with a big man okay so now let's go let's go back to vid iq so now we realize this keyword isn't good for us to and it's not good for us to target at all so now at the right side which is key re related keywords so as you can see we have traveling talisman problems okay so you can see the search volume is 65,000 plus. So that means 65,000 or 65K searches are being done about this keyword every month. Okay. And when I click on it, okay, when I click on it, so you can see that the search volume is high, but the competition is very, very low. If the competition is low, then what are you waiting for? Let's challenge. Let's challenge. So that is where we realize this keyword is good for us to challenge. We can compete with the, sh the, the people, the little people who have created videos about this. So now, we have got a keyword, which is traveling talisman problem. You just have to copy this down. So what I do is I copy this, open a notepad okay then just paste it over there the what i do is i just write in front of it main keyword so this is the main keyword so then i go to tax so now i'm going to find tax okay so i'll just copy these keywords they are relating to the keyword you have chosen you can see you have related keywords so you just have to copy this okay copy so paste it over here and just delete the unnecessary ones okay yeah, so unnecessary ones okay uh, so delete this these are the unnecessary ones so you have three keywords okay the tsp is included i don't know what it means but tsp and i'll come down i'll scroll down and come to the matching terms okay and also copy this okay come in let me copy this copy this and do the same so delete this um so this is it um, let's see this. So these are another keyword, okay? So now I can also copy this as well. So just paste it over here. Then do same. Okay. So this is another two keywords. So these are the keywords that we have. So this is the main keywords. And these are the keywords you are going to use for the tax. Okay, so now we are done with that. We have we are done with that. So now let's scroll down. 
top trending videos for traveling talisman problem so these are the videos people have made targeting the keyword we have found okay so now for a better video we need to cross check what is special about their video and make sure we do much better to, than what they have made if they have done bet but if they have done a better video we are going to do best video all right so now so i'll just right click right click right click this right click i think four is okay let me close the other tabs to the right so uh so okay so four is cool so let's wait for the videos to open so you have to get time skim through the videos and find out what this video is about that's where you can get our video ideas and also determine what is so special about the videos that i have made search on google um the keyword okay so let's open this and let's copy our keyword okay just like this copy then search so this is the keyword so you want to know about traveling talisman problem okay so on wikipedia the problem was first formulated in 1930 and it's one of the most intensively studied problems in op in optimization it is used as a benchmark for many optimization okay so you can do a lot of search about this keyword gather ideas okay when you gather ideas about this keyword you create a video about it when you make a better search and create a better video what are you waiting for you will be ranked high on the search result youtube search result okay so if you have created a better video we are also going to create a best video okay about those keyword that we had on vid iq so now when i copy this keyword go to google uh, youtube and just search about this keyword like like this so you can see traveling salesperson problem what is traveling sales problem traveling sales problem salesman problem in operations traveling salesman problem so the this video keeps on changing okay so as time goes you can see tomorrow you will come and this video will be on top of the search result okay whilst you optimize the video very well you also appear right here if you use your keywords very carefully it can help you like that okay so i will i will teach you how you can integrate the vid iq um webmaster to uh, the extension the google chrome extension to google when whenever you visit youtube you can just um do a little research okay understand keywords so when i scroll down here you can see the overall score is high okay 66 okay now this is vid iq search panel okay so they are giving us certain ideas okay analytics about this video about this keyword okay so now when i scroll so you can see the top video that has the search okay is 981 views okay so the top video that has most of views is 981k views um so the creator is abdul bari abdul bari this man abdul bari okay that's the creator so that is this so you have other related keywords also here so now so when i click on this keyword like this now this is something we need to take into consideration you can see you have 30 vph what it means that this video now just check this video was uploaded four years ago now this vpah simply stands for view per hour okay view per hour yeah so that means this video is able to get 30 views per an hour okay so every hour they get 30 views okay so multiply that by 
24 hours which is a day okay so 30 multiplied by 24 let me use my calculator so you have 24 hours per day so i'm going to multiply if in case every hour you get 30 how much how many views are you going to get so 30 multiplied by um 24 so which is 720 per 720 views per day so multiply by seven which is seven days with one week okay multiply by seven so we have 5k so every week this channel gets 5k views okay so that means the keyword is very good okay so if you are able to get 5k for every week then that's cool okay so the vph here is 12 like that so okay so this video has a vp of 32 if you make a research you come here and the vph is very very low don't you do a video about it so let's say the vph is three okay three like this video okay so if the vp is three it's not going to help us so let's say every hour you get three views three multiplied by 24 hours which is one day you get 7 72 72 views okay multiplied by 7 so the whole of the week are going to go at 500 plus views and which is not best okay so when you are doing it keep a research also you have to um, look at the vph which is the view per hour okay if it is very high then it's good that every hour they get a lot of videos on it and it shows that the keyword is still working okay people are using the keyword okay this video was made four years ago it was trending four years ago that is why he was able to get a lot of views okay so right now is this keyword still trending are people searching about this keyword as we talk right now if yes that means the vph should be higher every hour we should be getting a higher vpa people might be watching this video every hour we, we should be getting a lot of views every hour a lot of views every hour if you're not getting a lot of views every hour that means this video is no more this keyword is no more important okay it was trending then but right now people are not caring about it okay so that is why it is good you take into consideration the vph the views per hour okay so now we've gotten our keywords we have we've understood the things we need to take into consideration before choosing keywords now we are going to get to the, our last topic let's go okay so our last topic is how to apply your keyword on your video using tubebuddy now the problem is you have understood what seo is you now understand youtube search engine optimization youtube seo you know the best tools out there now you have done your keyword research with vid iq now how are you going to after doing your keyword research with the vid iq you have created your video you've done your research you have drawn your video outline you've made a video about the keyword what will make youtube understand that this video that you are going to upload is about this keyword that you have selected what will make youtube understand that this video is what people are looking for or this video is about traveling talisman person what 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 will make youtube understand that is why we have to know how to apply the keywords on the video for youtube to understand that this video we are uploading is about this particular keyword okay so now let's proceed so now so i'm going to try and upload any video okay so just click on add okay upload video okay so i'm going to click on select files or you just can copy uh, just drag and drop over there i'm going to find just any video so i'm going to this okay so i want to upload this video so just select the video and open click on open okay so now this is it okay so this is the panel okay 
So I, I told you in the previous uh, topic that I'm going to teach you how you can add um, vidIQ as an extension, okay, as a Chrome extension, okay. So now let's go to Google, type vidIQ, IQ, uh, Chrome extension, Chrome extension, okay. So I'll just like that. Okay, so as you can see, you have Red IQ extension. So I'll leave the link at the description down below for easy access. You can do that on Firefox as well. Okay, just cl click on this. So I'll leave the link at the description. You click on it and you just you will be redirected to this wonderful page. Okay, so just click on install Chrome extension. Okay. So now I have installed it. Okay, so when I click on remove from Chrome, let's say remove. Okay, so now it has been removed. So when I click on add to Chrome, then I click on add extension. So it's checking. Okay, so now it has been installed. So it has been installed. So what we have to do is um, we don't have to do anything. Okay. You don't have to do anything so success we are redirecting you back to youtube okay so now it has been installed okay so that is it so if you want to do the vph search that is simple as a b c okay so we are done with that um so hello everyone and welcome to Vi so let's search about uh, yes you so you can see two body over here okay so I'll leave the link at the description down below for you, okay? Just click on TubeBuddy as well. That's what we are going to use to implement that keyword that we did, okay, on our YouTube video. For YouTube to understand what that video is all about. So I'm going to add, click Add to Chrome. Add extension. Okay, so it is downloading the extension okay so now it's checking okay let's give it a time maybe 100 hours later or am i going crazy <laughs> so let's let's wait and see okay so now that is it so now you need to sign up okay just click on sign in over here so click sign in with google okay so you just choose your google account so i'm going to use this so that is it okay so you can just click on add channel like this and add your channel you get it so this is my channel so i'm going to use this email so my channel is within this email so i just click on this email and i have to choose my channel which is a sas techies and now the name has been has been changed okay to sas media so click on allow So that is it. So it has been added. Okay. So we are done with this. We are done here. We are going back to YouTube. They are going to add it over there. Back to YouTube. Okay. So when I click here, then go to YouTube Studio. Okay. So as you can see, this is two body icon. Okay. So I'm going to click on that and see if I have signed in to this. Okay. Just click here okay so now as you can see i've signed in to this okay if you are seeing this you have signed in if you if they prompt you to sign in then you need to sign in so that is it i'm okay so i'm going back okay i'm going to continue with the upload so now so the video is uploading so comp uh, checks completed no issues found okay so now this is the first one the first intro the first is the title how can we get best titles okay so the best option that i do or the best option the best practice is just use your keyword the first just have to just copy your keyword and just paste it or maybe type your keyword over here that is the best practice so after you have typed your keyword you can add this sign then add anything else let's say best ever in 2022 in 2022 okay 
you can say good experience so this additional uh, this additional phrase that we are adding will help people get attracted to the video okay we all know that they are looking for a talisman sales salesman problem we all know this is what they are searching about but what will make them click on a video what will make them click on the video is when the title is very engaging okay if the title is really really engaging then they are going to click on it so you need to add some keywords or some phrase that will make people click on it so good experience ever i mean best ever best ever in 2022 okay you see something like this so with this you are making it look attractive so when they are looking at keywords okay they can see hey, okay so this is the best ever video that we can add. okay if this is the best ever video then i have to click on this video and go and watch how best this video is they, they are going to now find out how best this video is so when they click on this they are, they are going to watch the video and find out the, how best this video is as compared to the other videos people have created okay so that is it so after you have added that you come back to your description paste so i have a template okay which i so let me just delete everything in this okay so it will be empty like this you just have to paste your top keyword your keyword your keyword should be the starting of your description okay so you need to write something engaging about your video okay so what is your video all about how is your video talking about talisman sales problem so you can say maybe traveling sales man uh, salesman problem um i have ever witnessed is in this video or has been guarded in this video okay so make sure make sure that the keyword you have chosen appears more than three times in the description note make sure your selected keyword has appeared more than three times in your description you get it wow so after these keywords has appeared more than three times in the description now you come to down of your video okay at the end of your description rather sorry so at the end of the description then you add three hash tags okay three hash tags so the first hashtag the first hashtag i'll talk about or i will recommend you to do is the main keyword so this is the main keyword delete every spaces okay so this is your main keyword the second keyword if your youtube channel is new add your channel name over there okay if it is new add your channel name if it is not new you have added a lot of tags about your channel then leave it like that okay the next one talk about traveling traveling sales man okay oh no space no space okay so the last the last hashtag can be sales sales man uh, sorry no space problem okay so these are the three hashtags we are, we are we are using okay so now we are good let's talk about our video thumbnail okay let's talk about video thumbnail so uh, we need to create a nice design okay for our video thumbnail okay so i don't want us to go deeper into this i'll create a special video on how to create a video thumbnail okay and with the help of tubebuddy we are going to create a very powerful video thumbnail okay a very attractive one so i will do i will attack that on next video 
this video might be very very long okay and we don't want to do like that do and we don't want that to happen okay so that's it so when you scroll you just select a playlist and just add your playlist i'm talking about so now uh yes so you might be seeing this make sure your video is no it's not made for kiss so when they ask you about your audience type tell them no it's not made for kids okay we are adults so when you just have to click show more then scroll to tax that's we are going to make use of what we have noted down in our notepad okay just go and open your notepad where you entered your keywords okay so first i'm going to just type in the main keyword which should be the first one just paste over there that's the main keyword back to the second okay just copy this come in let me do it this way uh, this way okay so i'm going to copy the first this is the first this is my problem so i'm going to copy this as my second tag okay then paste it over here go back copy this again oh sorry copy this and paste uh, copy this okay so i have copied um all the keywords in our tax and make sure it shouldn't be more than 500 okay okay it shouldn't be more than 500 my best practice is after that you just try adding adding yours okay so sales sales man problem uh, problem okay and then sales man traveling sales man so still read iq is working over here okay read iq is working over here okay so now this you, you choose your video language okay my video language is english why because um, people might filter that they want english as their main language okay uh, okay so choose your recording date um so this is today and location ghana so why is it important to add your location video location because people search about videos some some of some of the people search about videos concerning locations okay so they might maybe be like uh, maybe traveling talisman problem in ghana because your video your video location is ghana youtube will show your video as a result okay so that is it and also on youtube you have a filter section where you can filter okay so when you search our keyword you can filter and make the location ghana so if you are in ghana you made this video your video is going to show simple as that okay so that is it so let's scroll down make sure alliances is standard youtube alliances so we are all good i normally hold potential and appropriate okay so now so that is it okay that is it that is it so now click next Okay, so you can add add end screen and add cards. Okay, so you just click on add cards. Okay, now that will appear at the end of your video. So let's click on this. So here yeah, should be just click on this playlist. Which playlist do you want? I'm going to use internet, uh, something like that. The, the, okay, so the video should be the best for the viewer. Okay, and click on save. I can add a cart as well. Just click on this. Just choose. Click on this place. I can click on video. Choose any video on my YouTube channel. Or you can search about other. So you can see this place. 
okay so once someone which is what is it watching the video and get to this point this um will show so if the person is interested we just click on that and click on the video and the person will be redirected to that particular video okay so it will be easy for people to navigate your videos in very easy way okay so after you are done just click on save okay so if you are done just click on next so they have checked and there's no copyright issue just click on next so this part is where you are going to finalize your upload okay so you can choose to make it public instantly or you can schedule it okay so you can schedule it that is the best thing you need to schedule your video let's say looking at this time it's 6 16 that i'm making this video with this 6 15 that i'm making this video i don't want to upload this on 6 15 okay so i want to upload it tomorrow maybe around 12 p.m okay 6 16 p.m over here i want it i want to upload it tomorrow 12 p.m so i'll just choose tomorrow's date which is 27th okay then then change this to p.m just click on it click on it and select 12 12 you have 12 12 12 12 pm 12 uh, yeah you have 12 pm or just click on that and it has been selected so when you click on schedule so with schedule we are going to wait so tomorrow 12 pm before your video will be uploaded so when i search about this video i will not find it because it has not been what uploaded okay click close okay so i want to uh, refresh this page uh, i want to use a two body okay huh. i want to use a two body so i'm going to refresh and see if i'll get the two body section then i will go and edit our details once again and i'll show you certain points all right so now two body is over here okay so when i click on uh, this pen over here click on this pen details okay okay so now yes so two body is giving you an option that you can add chapters okay and two body is giving you i'll create a video about chapters okay and two body is giving you an option to create thumbnail as i told you about i'll be doing that in the next video so let's say i click on thumbnail over here okay so now you can still frame from video click solid color i normally use solid color okay so you choose any color that you want okay next continue so you, you can just bring out shapes okay let's say i want this uh the shape was over there uh, okay this is the shape just click on here and select a different color choose you can so you can make this you can make a terminal with this okay so i'll make a special video for this let's close this okay so when i scroll down to this section so this is the vid iq section okay this is vid iq section so so they are trying to tell me that my tag counts is very small so i should add a lot of ta uh, tags okay so they are saying the keywords in the description is five over five so for the description i'm cool i'm cool to go okay at the description and they are saying the keywords is tripled okay keywords and it's very good the keywords is five by five i've used the keywords completely we have the tax volume is low because the tax count is very low so you have to add a lot of tax okay then when i go to the tax section i can add they have given me a, they have given me a relating tax okay a, a related tax a recommended tax okay so they have given me a recommended tax so, so when i click on that it will be added okay just click on it and it has been what added so i can refresh and see if i can get any other tax if i don't get any other tax okay cool the iq uh temp uh, my theme is blue okay so when i scroll down you can see um this tag this design means uh, it's too bad okay so they are also they have also given me a relating keywords okay so when i click on this 
uh, it will be added to the tax okay when i go back to the tax when i scroll back to the tax uh, it will be added okay it will be added so that is it so that is it uh, that, that is it okay um so i want to go back and um come in so i want to well, come in can you give me okay let me add another tag okay let me add this relating tag that they're giving me so after i'm done with everything i just click on save okay so i can just click on save so now just click on this video over here welcome to sharpie tech welcome the best tech lesson platform okay so this is the video um this is the video i i have uploaded okay so i want us to explore the power of two body okay okay so when i scroll down over here so you can see the total views i have on this video is one okay and the total views i have on this channel is 5k okay and this is the seo score 90. so when i click on this click to load a ranked tax when i click on it let's see okay so so the number of tax which has been ranked will show here so you can do research okay about that tax on set which means when when you see that you have tax which has been ranked which means that the tax that you have or the keywords that shows in the tags that have been ranked when you search about that keyword you are going to see your video in that list and a number will be attached to it okay okay so now click on this side and i want to i want to upload it okay i want to upload it uh, let's change this to um, to today um, 6 40 okay 6 40 6 40 pm so we can upload it 6 40 click on this 7 45 i'm going to edit it okay so i've made it 6 45 pm so by 6 45 pm this video should be live okay it should be public on youtube okay so i'll click on schedule or better still let me just save and publish okay so just click here okay so let's proceed so just have to mark here save and publish okay and it should be public okay and publish okay okay so now uh, the visibility is public okay so that means this video is now on, available on what on youtube okay so when i click here view on youtube so we are going to check the power of vidIQ once again and this the power of this vidIQ i normally use it when or after i upload welcome to sharpie my tech video. the best tech lesson platform okay if you have not subscribed to this youtube channel kindly subscribe okay uh, you're almost getting to the point to the end point okay i know you've learned a lot okay so just appreciate me by just liking this video all right okay so now let's scroll to the vid iq section okay so this is the vid iq section okay so video video latex okay so we have two views total views uh, we have create a suggested video so if we have we have videos which is relating to this video i have created so the suggested video will have appeared here and i've i keep on saying that suggested videos is the second most traffic source that we get on our videos okay so when i click on ranked tax okay just click on ranked tax so youtube um two body is trying to tell me two of my video two of my tax has been ranked on search engine so when i scroll down to it so you can see that what is traveling problem and how it is modeled as a graph 
problem so when someone search about this keyword okay my video will appear so when i copy okay let me copy that i want to copy okay so okay so the 12 you see means that when you search on youtube the, about when you search the this keyword on youtube my video is the 12 okay on the list so the first video second and, and the 12th one on the list is my video okay so when i go to youtube and search about this keyword my video should appear on the 12th position okay are you feeling heartbroken over a copyright claim on your latest video look it's not you Okay, so I'm going to set paste it over here and click on search. So if you upload a video and you one when you when you check there, when you check here, uh, when when you check here and rank tags, you don't have any rank tags over there. That that means you haven't done a good job. You need to go and review your optimization. Okay. So this is it. So when I scroll, so this is a one. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so it has increased. Okay, so now this video is now on the ninth. Okay, so it keeps on changing. Okay. They keep on changing so when i refresh you can you can you will see that uh, this 12 will change okay to something like 9 or 8 or maybe 10. okay so you keep on changing keep on changing so now youtube is trying to read your content it's right it's trying to read everything about that video and understand it better to run welcome to shopee tech okay? the best much better on the search query so it's very very simple so if you have any questions just leave it at the comment section so this brings us to the end of the video okay so when i scroll i scroll and i click on rank tags once again i want to check if uh, number of tags has increased okay um, network is a little slow okay uh, okay so right now i have six tags which has which my video has been ranked for okay so when i scroll so you can see so this tag is doing well this tag is doing well this tag is doing well this tag is doing well, this tag is doing well. so when you copy this and search you will see my video in when you search about this keyword my video will appear when you search about this this uh, keyword my video will appear when I, you search about this keyword my video will appear when you search about this keyword my video will appear so my videos is appearing on um six of my tags so that means we have optimized it very cool okay so this brings us to the end of the video okay if you haven't subscribed just take time and subscribe appreciate my effort by liking this video okay if you have any question or suggestion just leave it at the comment section and if you want to help this channel at the description down below you will see a patreon link okay a patreon link just click and donate to help this channel this is Shapitek, the best for you. Let's meet next time. Goodbye.